This is the future. Future. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and if you are wondering what in the f is happening here well I have some water damage first of all which means in the following upcoming few weeks or months we have to seal this roof because all the water um, I think came through here between the sheets so I've got luckily I've got some sealant I've got some stuff to seal the roof with um, it's here I've never ever used it before in my life but we're gonna use that and we're gonna fix this roof luckily now it's autumn winter autumn solid winter so our rain season is basically over and done but now look at this boxes they are totally I have to replace whatever's in there into a different box I'm gonna wait for this floor to dry and uh, but that's not the main reason oh look my speakers damage to my speakers the speakers still work but I mean the boxes are stuffed um, but this is not what this video is about actually this video is about me having to rearrange my entire life again because we need to split the kids rooms yeah you guys know what that means it means I have to move the study back into the garage. The garage must be converted to the multifunction that it was going to be in the original with the, the gym and the, everything in it. And then we have to move the kids' bed into that one, but first I have to sort out all this shit to make space. So, okay, guys, so I'm just waiting for this to dry now. I cleaned the floor, I packed up what I wanted to pack up, I placed the. the Luckily, the uh, other box was like screws and bolts and nuts, so I put it back in a dry box, wiped them down, got a whole nice bag full of crap and nonsense that I was going to throw away. So, uh, it's not going too bad, it's actually maybe a blessing in disguise. Hi guys! So just a quick update, this is day two of the move. The windy house is sorted out, and all the stuff that was in here that I didn't want in the garage is in the Wendy. So the Wendy is packed full again. There's no place for nothing in that Wendy. This chair is gonna go into the house now so that this chair is out of the way. And then the idea is to move the gym into the back corner there, uh, move this toolboxes under there, and then start separating the wash, oh, sorry, the wash section. <laughs> The laundry section from the study because the study will be open plan study and gym combination with the washroom this side so let us see how far I can get okay guys just a quick update this is how far I got so far I had to take the portraits down because they were in my way of my plans <laughs> but the gym corner is done the gym is gonna stand there that's the bench there's some of my tools, that is the freezer and the other tool boxes is down there and then this will be the, the study corner. Okay guys, this is day three and this is as far as I got. So this uh, is my wash washroom section with a partition and it's more than enough that you need. Then you've got your study section. Um, unfortunately this cabinet did reduce the space extremely extremely a lot but yeah guys who are used to working in cubicles yeah you'll know it'll look familiar <laughs> the size space the screens are up and running the pc is down there so that's up and running the fridge is here then uh we've got a little bit of uh the rest of the study on this side intruding into the gym section or is the gym section intruding into the study you can take it both ways then we've got the tools the tool section here and of course the freezer box a deep freeze so everything is in 
As you can see, there's an empty shelf. There's still a lot of stuff that needs to come in, but now it comes to sorting. Now I have to sort out everything that I need to sort out and clean and uh, yeah, pack away some stuff and just make it nice and neat. Uh, I just have to connect the amp to get the sound in this place so these speakers can work. And yeah, then we have a lot of reshuffling and stuff to do. The bedroom, so this is going to be my son's bedroom now. So as you guys can see, all this crap still has to go to that side. At least now he gets his board back. And I'm going to first clean this room and then we're going to move his bed in here and everything. And split the toys and so on. So yeah, there's still a lot of work to do. There we go guys, here's the oldest son's bedroom now. So I'm at least done with um, this one. They are crazy about dinosaurs. And I packed his toys, there's so all he needs to do now is get his bookshelf. Uh, this is like chalk paint so he can write on it. So all he needs now is uh, maybe a small dustbin, uh, a bookcase for his books, and he's got his shelves for his toys. And most of his toys are still with his brother anyway. So. One room, done. Well guys, this is the end of the vlog. You, uh, I've, I'm done. This will be now the, the washroom section with the washing machine and all, whatever all you need. Coming into the study section. Um, I know it's small, it's cramped, but if you're used to working in a cubicle, then this should be fine. And I must say, I'm actually uh, getting used to my, um, my location, so it's all right. Um, talk about all the books and everything that I had in here. We've, got, we've just rearranged that shelf a bit. Uh, I've got my PC in here, I've got my fridge and my amp in here. Uh, and then we move into the gym section. I did test uh, the space, everything is fine, nothing is in the way, everything is working. I can just move the bench up a little bit. So. Uh, the gym is working fine and lastly is the toolboxes, the tool section and the freezer box. So everything worked out perfectly. It took me about five days to get everything sorted but yeah it is done. Hey guys if you like this video please consider subscribing to this channel. Give me a thumbs up because it will really help out this channel. And feel free to drop a comment. Then something new for you all, there's now a Facebook page, so feel free to follow me on my Facebook group. We will be discussing behind the scene features and videos that I have done. Also, don't forget to go to my website at www.cripzone.co.za where you can go straight to my podcast if you want to. By clicking on the podcast icon, you'll be taken straight to the Anchor podcast page where I do my podcast. And remember, when you go to my YouTube page, there will be a place where you can subscribe to my channel. Um, and remember, if you have any comments, please feel free to drop me an email. And on my YouTube front page, there is now a PayPal donation button where you can feel free to donate to this channel to help it grow and to help to support me. Thanks for watching and until next time, cheers.